Welcome to lesson 50 of our Free Code Camps HTML and CSS section. Today we're going over override class declarations with inline styles. So we've proven that ID declarations override class declarations regardless of where they are declared in your style element. There are other ways that you can override CSS. Do you remember inline styles? Use an inline style to try to make our H1 element white. Remember, inline styles look like this. So we got our opening tag, our opening H1 tag, and we actually specify the style within the opening tag as opposed to writing it within the style tag. So it says, leave the blue text and pink text classes on your H1 element. So, inside of here, we're leaving all these, you know, class and IDs. All it's telling us, give your H1 element the inline style of color white. So inside here, your H1 element should be white. So in here... All we gotta do is specify style equals, let's see how they do it, coloring, okay, so then color and white. So, as you can see, since we applied the style within our H1 tag, it overrode any of these other things you know since it has an ID of orange text and it has these two classes of pink text and blue text they're all overridden and only this style within um, the H1 tag or as they call it here inline inline style so inline style will override classes and IDs as we can see so that should be it for this for this lesson bullseye